Hello, Charlie. Do you want to sing me a song? Come on, United! The first 60 minutes. Yeah. Well, that was yeah. just completely yeah. disappointed. Too many chances missed. What's in a game? <laughs> Rubbish. Come on, you <laughs> Darren, how does it feel to have signed my shirt? That was a tough game. We were actually cack. Put a bomb up our ass, you know what I mean? Not going to make any excuses. Spurs played well. We play poor. How much you reckon I can get for this on eBay, though, John? Well, Arsenal, we weren't even alive today, mate. You know what I mean? We came alive when Gibbsy came on. I just wanted more oomph in the game. Subscribe to Cheeky School. Have more faith in George Michael. Campbell needs to, like, play like he wants to be on ace trade. <laughs> oh! I won. United won. City drew. Liverpool lost. Arsenal drew. Come on, United! My name's Cheeky Sport Joe, and today we're at the Emirates, where Tottenham drew 1-1 with Arsenal. Arsenal fans, not very happy about the performance. Are you happy about today? Yeah! yeah. Let's go and speak to the fans and see what they have to say. Let's go, come on. I mean, a few chances uh, fell towards uh, the main man, Giroud, today, right? Yeah, he had a few chances, but didn't happen for him on the day. We love Giroud, right? Yeah. Giroud looks good. He, he, does the he does the shampoo adverts, he does the, you know, he does all of that. When he's on form, he's good. Is he ever going to be on form in the big games? Yeah. Worst player? That's, that's a difficult question. I'd say Giroud. Yeah, he hasn't, he hasn't scored his goals. But we had a chance to go top of the league and we didn't take it. That was winnable. Frustrating. Frustrating. Spurs were better side. I yeah. hate to say it. It kills me. It's like, I'm going to lose a lot of respect for saying that, but one thing I want to do, Joel, is tell you the truth. And the reason why I'm telling you the truth is because we were actually cack. We were awful. We were awful in the first half. You would have thought the Spurs were the only team, and Spurs were the only North London side because they wanted it badly. Mm. We bought on them Flamini. He kind of, not so much changed it, it was just his presence made us, you know, put a bomb up our ass, you know what I mean? And it made us sort of instill a lot of passion into our game. I'm being, I'm being kind, okay? We needed some speed on the width. Do, do they need kind right now or do they need honesty? Campbell's a, Campbell's a nice boy, but you know, you know, I don't, another kind player. There's chances that we had, didn't take, you know, and also check kept us in a game. And for me, Francis Cochran, he always, always plays every game like a derby and today was no different. A few gooners saying today that, you know, did well to come back in and get the point, but for me, drawing at home to Tottenham is always, always a bad result. You know, I'm never, ever going to be happy to draw, to draw against Tottenham at home. So yeah, I'm disappointed today, man. Hey, Chamber. Can you, can you sign my picture? Oh my gosh, this is Chamber. Just signed, just signed the Yeah, thank you very much. Oh my gosh, this is going on eBay. Thanks. <laughs> You're a legend, Jack. Thank you. Are you calling Wenger to tell him to make a few transfers? Danny Welbeck out, obviously. He's always out. He's always out, but he's coming back in two months. Uh, uh, Wenger says... That's a long time. Nah, it's not that long, because we've got the... Not when you're an Arsenal fan. <laughs> if we stacked up 20 teams, and we said in proportion to their squad, who's going to have the most injuries? I would say we would. It would be Arsenal. We've got nine major injuries. Like We didn't know we were going to get nine major injuries, are we? Look, when our injuries come back after Christmas, we'll be firing again, OK? we got um, Wilshire coming back next month. Yeah, and he'll probably play for a couple months and then be out again. <laughs> nah. How much do you want to bet he's going to get injured again I'm before the end of the season? A hundred pounds. I'm saying he'll get injured again before the end of the season. Yeah, I'm trying to win some money. You're trying to win some money on a yeah, bet? Yeah, no, why would he get injured? Of course, Cedric from is a fantastic player. Yeah, but he's, he's going to get injured again before the end of the season. And why is your belief in that? Why do you have that, that negativism? But look at his injury record. He's, he's made out of plastic. He's made out of plastic? Yeah. And you're sure of that? Scientifically? And why don't we put up the PNG of all his injuries? Oh my days, it's Darren Fletcher! Once a red, always a red. Come on, United! Come on! <laughs> Darren, 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 Darren. Darren, how does it feel to have signed my shirt? It feels good, right? It feels, it's a great sensation! Darren! I've been winning all weekend in sunny Las Vegas. My greatest win was asking Casper Schmeichel what it felt like to be Peter Schmeichel's son. Do you wake up in the morning like, oh my days? I'm Peter Schmeichel's son! Hold on. 999? Come on! <laughs> um, no, don't wake up like that. Uh, is the honest answer now. Big shout out to Cheeky Sport, you know what's going on. Big shout out to Cheeky Sport. Cheeky Sport, you know. Congratulations.
congratulations to our FIFA winner. How does it feel? No, it feels amazing. Like, it feels amazing. Yeah, thank you, Cheek Sport, for the FIFA Well, that's it for today. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Comment below where you would like us to go next. My name's Cheeky Sport Joe. And we're out. Bastion, please. Bastion, please. Can you show him my hand, please? Oh, yes. Yes, Bastion. Oh, my days. And I've just found the Cheeky Sports boys in the middle of the street making our day and absolutely.